You guys know I like to keep my tutorials as short as possible. So I want to show you a nifty little tool that I downloaded called a float. And what it does is once you install it, I'll put the link below, um, you can pull up your different um, you know applications and tools um, for instance Terry White here um, I learned a lot from him I watch his tutorials you can see this video right here is 40 minutes and 6 seconds so I would like to take notes however switching between different screens is kind of a nuisance so what I do is I pull up my application here my notepad and I go to window and I go to transparency and I go to translucent and it, I'm able to see through it now so if I go back here to window adjust effects and I'm able to bring it down even more make it even lighter and then I can say I can make this more opaque when I come over top of it and use it here um, but I'm going to keep it transparent and I'm going to go ahead and hit done here so now what I'm going to also do is I'm going to go to a float and I'm going to say keep it afloat so it's going to stay on top of the other windows. So when I come over here to Terry White's video, I'm able to, um, you know, start his, um, you know, tutorial here. Let me move this window down a little bit and I can come over here. I can start it. I went ahead and muted it because I don't necessarily want to hear um, for the sake of this video. So I'm going to select inside here and as I'm listening and I'm learning from him and he's teaching me um, how to use Photoshop, I'm able to take notes, you know, and I'm able to see my notes. They don't have to really be, you know, all that clear in order for me to see it. Um, this right here works with text edit tool in Photoshop is I mean <laughs> over here on my computer as well which is a white background versus the yellow background or whatever the case may be so I mean it's a great tool um, while Terry's talking I can say T-E-R-R-Y W-H-I T-E and I'm able to take notes and really learn and have my notes um, after I'm done here I go back to window and I can say turn you know back to normal and here's all my notes and everything and I have a copy of notes in reference to everything that I learned really cool really nifty tool um, I use it quite a bit on a lot of different applications and it pretty much works with almost every application on the Mac here you just go to Windows and see if it's there so look for the link below and um, thank you for watching and I will see you guys in the next tutorial alright bye bye